It's Wednesday. I'm going to solve the Wednesday puzzle. What will we get? Will it be a continuation? There is a little theme going on with Mondays and Tuesdays puzzles. I don't want to spoil them for you, but if you if you solve them or watch my videos, you know what I'm talking about. But maybe we'll get more. Maybe we won't. I don't know. Let's find out. Sean Z. Barth is the constructor. I am Steve. This is Watch Steve Solve. I am the solver. Here we go. We have Kit Kat component. Give me a break. I don't know. Uh, it's got candy. It's got uh, um, uh, wafer. That's what it is. Wafer. Uh, heel over. I don't know. Ruler. Is that Inca? I don't know. Words before darn. I'll be darned. Ice cream and hearts may melt. Uh, transport up a bunny hill. I think it's the J bar, but I'm going to go with the rope. Um, Co founded the. Oh, it was Ida Tarbell, right? Uh, Ida Tarbell. Some buns in brief are sacks. Eggs. Okay. Wheeze. Yep. Hawkeye was Alan All Dunk. Little goodies are flapjacks. Uh, what's this, Jay? Uh, go tell it on the mountain. I don't know. Novelist and civil rights activist. I don't know. Competes for, runs for something. Enemy or, uh, oh, the Spectre, but that's not right. Um, a big name. I don't know. Uh, that's all she wrote. Uh, a BTS. It's not Ida Tarb. Oh, it's Ida B. Wells. Ida B. Wells. Wait, no. Ida, oh, what the heck. Ah, uh, okay. Give juice to Rev. Wait, what? Competes for could be runs, could be vies. I don't. I don't know now. Um, it's not Spectre. That's all she wrote. <sighs> all right, let's go somewhere else. We're through. I don't know. Where does he see Timberwolves batter the Battle of the Grizzlies? Uh, NBA, NBA court. Uh, oh, court. How about that? Um, so maybe some bunts are not. Ah, are not sacks. Mojave flora are cacti. All right, crime of combustion is arson. So ruler, I don't in Quechua, I don't know. We're uh, transport up a bunny hill. It is the T bar or the J bar. Let's go with T bar. Uh, this is Inca ruler in Quechua. That makes sense. NBA, oh NBA TV. <laughs> we are through. It's over. Yeah, there we go. GPs. Oh, Eureka was as California's motto. GPs. GPs. General Petitioner. MDs. Um, okay. Oh, W. Okay. It's the W is being shown by two Vs. One way to crack. Uh, okay. So this I Ida B. Wells. Um, wait. Well, Wells. But the W is the letter V. We're stretching the W for some reason. Um, if it's maybe it's Spectre. Uh, I thought it was. Oh, Smirsh was it also in some of those movies? Yes. Okay. Heel over the scab to scab over. Uh, big name, boiling sensation. What? Something. Goodwin, John S. Goodwin, maybe. Fitz, I don't know. Eleven is once in Espanol, Spanish. One way to crack. I don't know. Holiday pie flavor is pecan. Automated tweeter. I don't know. Rib serving is a rack of ribs. Okay, king me in checkers. Um, in. Simpson, do they not have the chin? Ah, interesting. Throwing a tantrum, I don't know. Letter after phi, I think, is Kai. Interrupt as it answers to cut in. Does anybody do that? May I cut in? Um, road flare, I don't know. It's a warning, it's a warning signal. Um, throwing tantrum, acting out, that's what that is. Uh, let's go up here. Card game is Uno. Um, VCRs, uh, hardly any, a few. How about that? Like a song word, warbling? Um, now these W's are W's. What gives? At the top of the screen, the W's are double V's. Now they're W's. I don't understand. Um, World War Era usher in the civil rights movement and a hint to four answers in this puzzle. Something, okay. I don't know. This could be a V. Low cal diet. I don't know. This is, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. Um, African American post posthumous medal of honor. I don't know. Nest egg, initials be IRA. So this is not right. Hardly any. A tad, uh, a little, like a songbird. I don't know. Transcript stat, GPA. Okay, on the briny, a C. There we go. The stones and stone fruits are pits. Many, informally, lots of. There we go. Ways, way is a route or a route. Crap might make you jump. Boo! Um, is this W.E.B. Du Bois? Yes, got to be. So it's W. So W E B Du Bois. Okay, that fits. W W is an Earl. Yep. Hardly any a tad like a songbird warble. Um, peak perks. 
I don't know. Screen as a candidate is to vet. Uh, the key deaths are VMI, Virginia Military Institute. Uh, it's the it's, oh, warbly. It's an adjective. Okay, like a songbird is warbly. That's a fake word. I don't know about that. Whimper is to mule. Also a fake word. Um, peak perks are views. If you're at the peak, yes. So this is somebody Watson. Um, Silver State School is UNLV. Silver State is Nevada. Rank above a Viscount. How about Earl? Bodybuilding supplement would be GNC. Still don't know that. Let's go over here. Ana de Armas. Yours might be made up. Um, yours might be made up. I don't know. Um, uh, back away. Stay away. I don't know. Make a pit stop at a punk show. It's mosh! 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 Uh, spam folder, Durango Doze Peso, Ask Away, yes that works. Uh, in the past, a go. Selfless Courage is heroism. Um, uh, my better half, other half is a partner. Clear the board is to erase. Full spectrum is the gamut. Uh, yep, term, trimester, many place uses, yep. Sportfish, Mahi Mahi, R2D2. George Watson, okay, a fairy tale bad is an ogre, except for Trek. He was a goodie and an ogre. Um, double V. Helped usher in. I'm looking that up because I've never heard of this. Um, yours might be made up. Your mind is made up. Wait. Jam. This doesn't look right. Oh, this isn't right. Uh, this is Vise. Oh, James. Oh, James Goodwin. Yes. James. No, Goodwin. Not Godwin. Goodwin. Uh, big name is a celeb. No. James Baldwin. Not James Goodwin. Yeah. James Baldwin. Locale is light. There we go. Off base is AWOL. Um... Uh, absent without leave. BBC had flea bag. Oh yeah. All right. That felt a lot slower than it was. That's a decent time for for Wednesday. It's right around average, I think, for for what I've been doing lately. Uh, all right. So yeah. So we have all. I, this is. I mean, this could work any time, but it is also Black History Month. So we have Ida B. Wells. We have James Baldwin. We have George Watson, who I don't know. Received a posthumous Medal of Honor for Valor Service in World War II. And we have W.E.B. Du Bois, very, very, very famous. Um, and Double V, World War II era campaign, helped usher in the Civil Rights Movement. That means we're going to look it up. And if you're going, farewell. Thank you for watching. All right? I love making these puzzles because it's fun, but I love it even more because people are watching. So thank you for watching. If you haven't yet, please like the video and please subscribe to the channel. That lets me know you're doing this thing and you get to see every every day. It shows up and say, hey, watch Steve solve um, because it's a lot of fun. But I'm going to learn because this sounds cool. Double V. Um, here we go. Let's learn about this. Double V campaign. Maybe I have to look. Okay. Double V. Double verify. Double V campaign. Let's see what we got here. In the Pittsburgh Courier, African American newspaper launched a double victory campaign. Victory abroad and victory at home. I like that. Right? Because it's not just bad. it's not just right to defeat the enemy overseas, also to make this a better country. Thank you, Smithsonian Institution, for teaching me that. Um, victory abroad and victory at home. So it's a double V. So V for victory. Um, ah, I like that. Here we go. To 1942, democracy, double victory, democracy at home and abroad. Very cool. I never knew that. Then the largest black newspaper in the United States. Okay. Interesting. When World War II began, newspaper immediately made a connection between the U.S. treatment of African Americans and Nazi Germany's treatment of Jewish people. Ah, FDR said, please tone it down. Newspaper complied for a while, but then they didn't. They published a letter because here you had a guy who was helping out the war effort, but was wel welcome to help out the war effort, but could not work on the factory floor because it was segregated. Oh, uh, yeah. Should I sacrifice to live half American? Wow. That's pretty cool. Good job, James G. Thompson. That's nice. It's nice. V for victory was prominently across the U.S. among its allies over tyranny, slavery, and aggression. Double V for victory. I like that a lot. Cool. Oh, I like. I'm glad I learned this. Thank you. Um, you know, it's the kind of thing you could learn uh, in a history class, um, and probably should. Um, I mean, there's t tons of things to learn. Um, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna knock on my history teachers uh, or on the curriculum. Um, but that's the kind of thing that, that many people, myself included, well-educated Americans, 
did not learn it. Seems like it's a big deal. Um, so hey, good that I'm learning it in, in the crossword. Good I'm learning it somewhere. All right, anything else new here? I, those that was that was the biggie. Um, that was the biggie. All right, so I'm gonna call this a day. Uh, a couple fake words. I I don't know. I'm not a huge skier, but in my days of skiing, you would take the rope toe up the bunny hill. But rope is never in uh, crosswords, and T-bar often is in crosswords. Let me switch back to the bigger screen here. Um, so that one, this one totally looks fake. Warbly is, I'm looking that one up. Is that a word? Has anyone ever used warbly as a word? Um, all right, switch back, switch back. All right. Warbly, I don't know. War, Warby Parker, warbler, warble flies, warbler labs, warbly. Yeah, no, it's totally a fake word. It's a fake word. Fake word. Fake word. All right. Still fun, though. I mean, it fits. And I got you could get like itsy or something like that. I don't know. I'm not going to fix it. I don't write these things. Uh, man, my hat's off to those of you who do because it, it looks like it's pretty, pretty hard. Pretty cool. Um, but, uh, you know, it's easy to complain. There's plenty of people out there who complain. I'm not going to complain, although fake word but really cool uh cool uh cool uh, uh, uh theme so i like that thank you sean seabarth thank you very much uh for making this puzzle i appreciate it and for bringing it to us uh and i'm gonna sign off now i had a great time solving this puzzle uh i hope you enjoyed watching uh if you did please subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet please like please throw in a comment um say how why would you think it was james goodwin who the heck is james goodwin james baldwin everybody knows that yeah, okay. Um, but this is fun. I had fun. I hope you had fun. That's why we do it. And that's why we're going to keep doing it. And I'll see you in the future.